Hi guys, welcome back. So last time I showed you how to do this toilet paper effect all the way across here. It's pretty much dry now. I think it's dry enough that I can do what I need to do. Um, but if not, we'll have to pause the video and come back to it. But basically, you see how this is here? We're going to try and replicate that. I think I need to paint it gray because it's not quite covering it with the black. And I'm actually going to go over this here a little bit too because it's a different color gray than what they had. Okay, so now the whole thing is painted gray. I'm sorry I had to paint that two different colors because the original gray was not quite the same, so it didn't work out. Now I've got it all one color gray um, with a little bit of spots that I left light on the other one just to give it more um, contour and stuff. So now you just want to let it dry, and it's not completely dry yet, but just to kind of give you an idea of what needs to be done is you're going to just kind of like go over it and give it some depth with different colors. And just give it a little more contour. Now I can tell you this side is a little bit more raised. So because it's like that, you may want to go ahead and add a couple layers like I did over on this far side here. But I'm going to be putting a second step here to step down because this is too big of a step to have just by itself. So I'm only going to do the one layer and if it wasn't for the tutorial, I wouldn't have done it at all. And more than likely, I'm going to end up cutting this little square out where this step's going to go so I have something better to glue it to. And then um, I'll glue the step there and paint it to match the top. Alright, 
So here is just what I've done so far. And you just keep going over it back and forth, adding the different colors. I'm using a palette of brown, orange, green, gray, and black. And I'm kind of blending the colors as I go here and there, just kind of with it. And I'm using the same brush. I'm not changing the brush out. And that's so the color combination gets a little bit mixed in between all of it. Right here is still wet, so that's not done yet. I just kind of put some gray on there to get it started so when it dries. All right. 